Do you ever get the sense that your presence doesn't quite leave the impact you're aiming for? Or perhaps your words, even when respected, seem to miss that powerful punch you wish they had? It's something many of us deal with. We're often taught that respect revolves around achieving fame, amassing power, or flaunting high status. However, the truth about real, profound respect is far from these misconceptions. In this video, we're diving into the layers of true respect. We'll unveil 10 strategic gems that challenge the traditional norms of holding someone in high regard. These aren't about authority or status. They're the tools that nurture authentic, lasting respect. So, if you're eager to untangle the myths around respect and make people genuinely respect and admire you, dive right in. Number 1. Start with your self-respect Just like charity begins at home, respect finds its roots within oneself. Your self-respect sets the tone for how you engage with others. When you value yourself from within, you inspire others to respect you in the same manner. But how can you do it? Well, it starts with sending a clear message to the world that you're not a pushover. You're not someone who will let people walk over you. And it's not about arrogance or self-centeredness, but acknowledging your inherent value and not compromising it. When you lead with self-respect, you essentially make a statement to the world about your boundaries and the kind of treatment you deserve. It's akin to being the referee in a match, blowing the whistle on anything that disrespects your value. Number 2. Be the bigger person In our day-to-day -day conversations, situations can get knotty, making it a challenge to untangle without straining our relationships. But stepping up and being the bigger person? That's like choosing the thorny but true path, the path that gains you genuine respect. Being a bigger person is all about understanding the impact your words and actions have on others. It's about keeping your feelings aside and showing genuine care for their feelings. And mind you, it's a tough feat. When you're being the bigger person, you're not just letting go of the need to be right. You're also directing your focus to what truly matters and what needs to be done. This consideration and empathy for others' feelings are what truly earn you respect. In those pivotal moments, when you consciously choose not to prioritize your own position at the expense of someone else's emotions, you're displaying a rare and admirable quality. This act of selflessness and understanding is what garners deep and genuine respect from others. Number 3. Guard your availability While being helpful and available is great, intentionally limiting your availability can paradoxically increase the perceived value of your time and presence. Think about it. Who would you prioritize more? A friend available every day or a friend you know you can catch up with on weekends? The friend who is less frequently available holds more weight, right? Similarly, when you're constantly within reach every single time, people might inadvertently take your time for granted. So, start by identifying key time slots when you're most available and commit to being accessible during those moments. For the rest of the time, set boundaries, whether by turning off notifications, clearly communicating your availability, or dedicating those periods to personal commitments. This deliberate choice not only enhances the value of your presence during those available times, but also highlights the importance of your commitments and personal well-being. As others observe your consistent scheduling and respect for your time, they'll naturally begin to appreciate and honor those boundaries. Number 4. Stand up for opinions Standing up for your opinions serves as a cornerstone in gaining respect, and it's not about sparking conflicts. It goes beyond merely defending your beliefs. It's about championing your thoughts and needs when you know you're on point and the situation demands it. This practice showcases your self-assurance and self-respect, both pivotal in garnering admiration from others. It doesn't require aggression or argumentativeness. All it demands is the ability to confidently articulate your thoughts and feelings, especially in challenging times. People naturally admire those who assert themselves with grace and confidence. This manner of expressing your beliefs naturally commands respect, cultivating relationships built on mutual regard and openness. Number 5. Listen before you talk Ever had a time when you're talking and it feels like the other person isn't really hearing you? It's like they're just waiting for their turn to speak. And that's what this idea tries to fix. It's about flipping that game and really tuning in before you take the stage. Imagine it like a ping pong match. Instead of smacking the ball, your thoughts, right away, you pause and catch what the other person serves. You watch, you understand their slot, and then you send yours. It's about showing that their service matters just as much as your return. This isn't just about being polite. It's a powerhouse move to make your talks more worthwhile. So, how does this give you real respect? 
Well, when you show that you're not just waiting for your turn to speak, but genuinely trying to get where they're coming from, it's like giving them a big nod. They feel heard and valued, which is pretty awesome. It's like a fist bump to their thoughts and feelings. And you know what? When you treat someone's ideas as gold, they're more likely to see you as a trustworthy, respectful buddy. It's all about building respect, one chat at a time. Number 6. Keep your temper in check Did you know that your ability to manage your anger isn't solely a gift to your mental well-being? It's actually a profound skill that can significantly enhance the respect you receive. Yes, think of it as a superpower that goes beyond just personal well-being. There are moments in life that might test your patience. However, when you can keep your composure, especially in those challenging moments, it demonstrates a level of emotional intelligence and maturity that commands respect from others. And no, it's not about bottling up emotions, it's about expressing them in a way that positively impacts those around you. By handling anger gracefully, you show reliability and strength, becoming someone others can count on. So, the respect you gain isn't just about you, it's about the impact you have on those around you. It's a demonstration of your leadership and a quality people admire and seek to emulate. It's a valuable skill that not only improves your personal life, but also influences how others perceive and respect you in various aspects of life. Number 7. A firm speech The way we communicate has a profound impact on how others perceive us. The strength and clarity with which we deliver our words play a pivotal role in how we're seen by others. So, when we stumble or struggle to articulate our thoughts, it can unfortunately cast doubt on our confidence and personality. Confidence in speech isn't just about sounding sure, it's about the conviction and assurance we convey through our words. When we speak clearly and assertively, it not only communicates the importance of our message, but also reflects our belief in what we're saying. This, in turn, influences how others respect and perceive us. A strong and unwavering delivery is like a stamp of authority in communication. It doesn't just affect our personal interactions, it also shapes how others view our capabilities and reliability. It's a fundamental aspect of building trust and respect in various aspects of our lives. Number 8. Avoid oversharing Sharing is caring, but sometimes less is more. Yes, oversharing or giving out too much personal information can sometimes negatively affect how others see you. Think of it as sharing too many puzzle pieces. It takes away the mystery and might make people uncomfortable or overwhelmed. When we overshare, it's like you're flooding someone with too much detail. It can overshadow the respect you're trying to build. So, if you tell someone every single detail about your life, it might dilute the value of the important stuff you share. It's not about being secretive, it's about finding the right balance. When you share just enough, it keeps things interesting and maintains a level of respect. It's like leaving some puzzle pieces out to keep the intrigue alive. By finding that balance, you're not just respecting your own privacy, but also respecting the comfort levels of those you're sharing with. Number 9. Keep Your Promises Keeping your word is one of the simplest and most powerful ways to earn respect. When you consistently follow through on your commitments, you become a beacon of reliability. And reliability is at the core of respect because it's a tangible demonstration of your trustworthiness. Keeping promises is like making a pact with others. It's not just about fulfilling a commitment, it's about upholding your integrity. Your words match your actions, and that kind of consistency forms a sturdy foundation for respect in any relationship, be it personal or professional. When you become known as someone who keeps their word, people can rely on you without hesitation. Trust flourishes and respect follows naturally. Whether it's a small favor for a friend or a significant work project, being true to your word is a timeless and universally appreciated value that garners respect from all corners of life. Number 10. Give respect to get respect. Respect is a two-way street. While you work to earn it, don't make it a condition for giving it. Treating people with kindness, consideration, and respect is often reciprocated. Creating a culture of mutual respect is the key to both gaining and keeping respect from others. It's a simple but powerful principle. When you respect others, they tend to respect you in return. By showing consideration and kindness, you foster an environment where respect naturally thrives. This isn't about demanding respect, it's about creating a positive cycle of respect and understanding in your interactions. So remember, if you want respect, start by giving it. It's a fundamental aspect of building healthy relationships, whether in your personal or professional life. If you have made it this far, comment down below with the word 100% to confirm that you have received the knowledge from this video. 
For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.